Hey guys, Zephyrnix here, and I'm going to make a response to that guy, Dark Saliva, or something like that. And, I don't know, I don't know, I don't care, really. Um, and this is my last response, and I'll go and explain to you my la reason why it's my last response at the end of the video. But, um, I'm going to go ahead and just kind of knock things out the park about what he said, and I'm not going to do um, too much, because to be honest with you, I only watched like half his video, if that, probably like 33% of his video, and I got bored. Really. I really just got like 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 aneurysm board and no I'll explain to you in the end. But let's go ahead and talk about this for a second. First of all, he says, I go to college, I go to college. Um, I do my own businesses and I speak other people's businesses, so why do I speak like this? Now, first of all, understand something. What the hell are you talking about speaking for other people's businesses? Um, it's called a publicist. And people have their own publicists and their own um, businesses. Why do they need me? I don't speak for people's businesses, dude. That's retarded for you to even think. I don't even understand where you're coming from with that. And I, I originally was going to dub you stupid on that that thing alone, but then I let it be. I let it be. Because I was like, well, it, it is a business venture. It is a business aspect, a business um, subject. So I can't really t touch too much on it. So basically... There's two ways that you can take what he said. You can take it either as um, number one, which I already explained to you in my first video, so I'm not going to sit there and explain to you again. Then there's a second part in which he's saying, you know, why do I speak like that? If I, if I, own, if I do my own college, and if I, if, excuse me, if I go to college or I own my own business, and let me put it this way, man. If you don't know that there are, that there's a time and place for everything, that means that there's a time and place to speaking Ebonics versus there's a time and place to speak the proper English that you need to speak when in a business um, aspect, then you are fucking retarded, dude. Are you serious? Do you not know that? Then again, I, I, maybe that's not retarded. Maybe your highest job is indeed Walmart. I mean, maybe, you know what? Maybe that is, you know? I need some slippers, dude. I need some, like, some nice little slippers. Maybe you can hook me up with a discount. Anyway, so last but not least, um... I gotta get into one other part. Now, this was like 50% of what I, how I decided to turn off the video. Because I totally lost respect for you. Because you continue to speak about all these bad things I'm saying, and uh, uh, I use the word nigga, 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 and how I did this. And then, I heard a child's voice in the background. Are you shitting me? So you're dropping all these things, you're talking about all this, and your fucking child is in the background, in the same room as you? Are you shitting me? By this time, I basically lost, like, about 99.7%, like, respect for you, to the point where I wasn't even paying attention to you no more. Like, seriously. Like, I mean, couldn't even, I couldn't even, I... I had to pause the video and walk away. That's how, like, that's how much that pissed me off. Are you shitting me? Are you sitting there? That contradicting, talking about how, you know, I'm disrespecting black people and I'm doing all this, and then you're sitting there dropping that bomb constantly. You're sitting there saying that word. You know, your problem is how I'm saying that word and blah, 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 blah. You have to say it a different way. Yet, at the same time, you're sitting there dropping that bomb in front of, of a child who doesn't even sound like she's over five? Really, dude. Really. So last but not least, um, and this is the other thing I lost the last 3% of respect for him. He goes, and he had to go on a uh, rant about how other people uh, understood what he was saying. And if you gotta, <laughs> if you gotta rely on what other people say, dude, I don't, I don't give a damn what you gotta say. Like, I really don't. Like, how do you sit there and, like, if you, I don't see how I need to be bothered with you if you can't even hold your own ground. You have to get, you have to go see other what other people say in order to feel like you are fighting the well-fought battle or some bullshit like that. I don't know. Anyway, let me put it this way, though, man. I'm actually looking at your video right now, and let's see. Zephonix fucked up with that statement. He meant to say, I'm guessing, oh. He meant to say, I'm guessing, oh, sorry. 
Um, NR1012 said, Zebanex fucked up with that statement. He meant to say, I'm guessing, hood or ebonics instead of black. C congratulations, he figured it out. Pretty simple. That's what I meant to say. I didn't mean to say black. I actually meant to say hood. The thing is, be honest with you, I could have redid the video, but I honestly didn't think some bullshit motherfucker like you was going to go ahead and rant, cry, and complain about it, about how I how I said uh, I speak black and also how I said the N-word while in the presence of his daughter. Sorry, I didn't see that coming. Michael, well, he's black, by the way, um, even though he said what he said on your page, he actually, when I explained myself, he understood what I was coming from then. So, what else? Um, Junaid, you're backing yourself with the uh, comments from Junaid? Dude, let me put it this way. There's a reason why no one respects Junaid. There's a reason why half the population doesn't give a damn about Junaid, okay? I'm just saying. I'm just saying, man. You might want to pay attention. Uh, what else? Um, Konami says, a few days ago, I'm surprised, even though I knew what he was trying to say. You know, maybe let me talk hood would be, have been a better choice. Like I said, Konami understood it too. Once again, I, like I said before, the reason why, you know, like I said, it actually came out as an accident. But overall, I didn't, I didn't change it. I didn't redo the video like I usually do because I didn't think that someone was going to take it seriously. And then... Like, you point at Black Bond. And let me put it this way. And he can take it, if he knows better, Black Bond knows better, he can take it offensively if he wants to. I don't give a rat's ass. Black Bond will pay, Black Bond is always the kind of guy who, while I do respect what the man says, the man sucks way too much dick. Okay? Seriously. All jokes aside. Black Bond is known for, and I'll sit there and listen. I, there was one video that True Set You Free did that it was so much patented common sense bullshit going on in that video that I was going to comment on it. And then I noticed that Black Bond had already made a comment, but he never said anything. So I sat there and didn't make a comment on it and actually sat back and listened to what he was, um, to see if Black Bond was actually going to say something. And other people said something, but it wound up being, um, Solid Rev, who actually made response to it. So, whatever's whatever. Now, so, I don't know. Personally speaking, when it comes to the, um, it depends on the subject matter in which I will take what Black Bond has to say. I've noticed that you kind of have to do that with him. Last but not least, who, I mean, who else do you have? No one else pretty much, um, say anything in remotely intelligent, they just kind of made responses. Last but not least, um, the reason why this would be a last response. Now, yeah, there's the whole part about you speaking in front of your daughter about that, which totally makes me lose respect for you. Like, seriously, I have, like, absolutely none. Like, you know, like, let me put it this way about how much respect I have for you right now. You know the water that's in a toilet bowl that you piss in? I don't respect you enough to put the, the blue bomber things in there to make it fresh water. I don't respect you enough to put the thing. If you represent that water in the toilet bowl, I don't respect you. To, I don't respect you enough to put that little blue thing and make it blue, just to make it clean. Seriously, like that's your equivalence to me right now. Just, just for that. The other stuff is secondary, but just for that, I gotta say, hey, that kills that 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 tears the fuck out of me. So that is one definite reason. And then there's this reason. Whether you agree with what I say, whether you don't agree with what I say, that's up to you, dude. But this is my channel. So I'm going to say whatever the hell I want to say. Okay? I'm, it's just I just point to it. I'm going to say, if you don't like what I have to say, you know what to do. This is something that I've said before. That I told El Presidente to say, and he definitely, he was like, you know what, you're right, and he said it. Sokyo, I'm thinking, got that idea from me too, and came back and said it to me, to, um, said it. Cardi, I'm believing, got it from Sokyo, and said the same thing too. But it all comes the same. My channel, bitch. You got a problem with what I say? Walk. And do me a favor, though. When you walk, 
Leave a comment at the bottom of the page saying how you're 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 fed up, you're mad, and you're going to un unsub me so I can laugh at you. Okay, do me a favor, because I really like a good laugh. So go ahead, bitch about it on the comment so I can laugh my ass off at you. You guys have a good night. I'm done with this motherfucker. Peace, bitch.